नमस्ते माय डियर फ्रेंड्स बेल फॉर अरविंद केजरीवाल फॉर स्किपिंग समन्स इन लीकर पॉलिसी केस अरविंद केजरीवाल द दिल्ली चीफ मिनिस्टर वायलेटेड सेक्शन 174 ऑफ द इंडियन पेनल कोड व्हेन ही स्किप्ड द एनफोर्समेंट डायरेक्टरेट्स रिपीटेड समन्स इन द अलेज्ड दिल्ली एक्साइज पॉलिसी स्कैम दत्ते दिल्ली चीफ मिनिस्टर अंदर अरविंद केजरीवाल हैज बीन ग्रांटेड बेल बाय दिल्लीज राउज एवन कोर्ट अगेंस्ट अरेस्ट फॉर स्किपिंग प्रोब एजेंसी समन्स इन द अलेज्ड दिल्ली एक्साइज पॉलिसी स्कीम ही वाज आज टू फर्निश ए पर्सनल बॉन्ड ऑफ रुपीज फिफ्टीन थाउजेंड एंड ए सिक्योरिटी बॉन्ड ऑफ रुपीज वन लैख फॉर द बेल द दिल्ली चीफ मिनिस्टर वायलेटेड सेक्शन वन हंड्रेड सेवेंटी फोर ऑफ द इंडियन पेनल कोड विच डील्स विद डिस ओबेइंग ए लीगल ऑर्डर टू बी एट ए सर्टन प्लेस इन पर्सन और बाई एजेंट वेन ई स्किप्ड द एनफोर्समेंट डायरेक्टोरेट रिपीटेड समन्स इन द अलेज्ड दिल्ली एक्साइज पॉलिसी स्कीम द कोर्ट समंड द आप चीफ आफ्टर द एनफोर्समेंट डायरेक्टोरेट विच वांट्स टू क्वेश्चन मिस्टर केजरीवाल इन कनेक्शन विद द दिल्ली एक्साइज पॉलिसी केस टोल्ड द कोर्ट दैट द चीफ मिनिस्टर स्किप्ड एट समन्स इशूड अंडर द प्रिवेंशन ऑफ मनी लॉन्ड्रिंग एक्ट Arvind Kejriwal will not have to appear in person for the next hearing of the case on April 1 skipping the ED summons Mr Kejriwal accused the Narendra Modi government of using central agencies to target opposition leader the ED's latest summons came late in the February and asked the chief minister to appear for questioning on March 4 However Mr Kejriwal who skipped the illegal summons said he would appear only through video conferencing but the financial probe agency insisted he appear physically and said there is no provision for questioning virtually top up leaders former delhi chief minister manish sisodia and rajya sabha mp sanjay singh have been arrested by the ed in a Money laundering case related to Delhi's now scrapped excise policy. Mr. Kejriwal's name cropped up multiple times in the ED charge sheet. The agency said that the accused in the case were in touch with the Chief Minister when the excise policy was being drafted. This bill is only for the ED's complaints. of kejriwal refusing to appear in for probe but ed can summon him again and he can be sent for jail so this is different case so thank you for watching this video namaskar my dear friends thank you Furnishing bail bonds of uh, worth uh, fifteen thousand rupees is what we're learning. Remember, Delhi Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal had appeared before the Rao's Avenue Court on ED complaints alleging non-compliance of summons issued by him, issued to him uh, by the ED. Uh, now he's been granted bail in this particular case. I have my colleague Ishika joining us with more details. Ishika, take us through what the court said at this point. We're learning that Kejriwal has been granted bail in the case where the ED had uh, demanded persecution uh, because he was not uh, he was not. complying with summons All right we'll try and get my colleague back on the broadcast but uh, remember this post comes uh, just uh, uh, after Delhi court on Friday had in fact rejected Arvind Kejriwal's plea to stay the summons on complaints that have been filed by the ED and uh, asked the Delhi chief minister to appear before it on Saturday remember earlier as well 
uh, Kejriwal was uh, uh, had to had to appear before the Rouse Avenue Court, but because of the Delhi budget that was taking place at that moment, he appeared uh, through video conferencing and had uh, then requested that the hearing be set on a on a later date. Uh, today, of course, uh, Kejriwal had uh, appeared before the court physically, and he's been granted bail on a furnishing a bail bond of fifteen thousand rupees. Now, remember, Kejriwal had challenged the summons which were issued by the magistrate court after taking cognizance of two complaints filed by the ED for avoidance of summons that were issued to him. Uh, remember, Kejriwal had skipped around eight summons that were issued by the enforcement directorate in the liquor policy case. Uh, the Delhi CM had also moved to the Sessions Court. Court has granted bail for that. Uh, now uh, uh, it would be enforcement directorate who can again reach out to the court and can f send fresh summons to Arvind Kejriwal in the Delhi uh, uh, liquor case as far as the investigation is concerned because he had ignored earlier eight summons in the Delhi uh, liquor policy case. We have been told that uh, uh, Delhi Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal appeared physically and uh, then after getting uh, a bail he left from the Rouse Avenue court. Uh, uh, remember, it was two earlier summons from the court that uh, was sent to him to which he stated that because of his official duties as chief minister and because of ongoing budget session, he was too busy and he could not reach out physically to the court. But today, uh, he appeared. Uh, he gets bail in both the complaints earlier filed by the ED for violating IPC section uh, uh, 174 and uh, this is not in relation with the excise policy case. So, a slight relief for him for not appearing and getting bail uh, but uh, certainly the enforcement directorate on their part can again summon him and can reach out to the court that he should be uh, available for further questioning uh, in the case as he is one of, uh, 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 he is not directly an accused but uh, uh, as a witness uh, in this particular case uh, as ED was uh, continuously summoning him, uh, they can again reach out and can ask him to appear before the enforcement directorate. Right, uh, Ashwarya, no, earlier in fact the, the ED had uh, filed a case like you said uh, saying that Kejriwal had uh, skipped summons that were issued by the agency and that as a public servant he's bound by uh, uh, bound by the law to appear before uh, the agency as and when summoned. Uh, what exactly was the justification that was given uh, from uh, the defence side? Well, uh, there were uh, eight summons, and in batches of three and uh, and mm. four, uh, you know, the enforcement director reached to the court earlier as well. In the first uh, 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 hearing, it was Sessions Court who had summoned Kejriwal on March 16. Second time after eight summons, he declined not to appear before the enforcement directorate. Again, the enforcement director reached the Sessions Court. In both the cases, it was March 16th, uh, today's date, which was given by the Sessions Court, in which again and again Arvind Kejriwal stated that because of his schedule uh, of election rallies and because his uh, official duties as uh, the chief minister and and the budget session did, that was uh, on the other it is K Kavita who yesterday was arrested and she has been kept at the ED headquarters uh, from here on K Kavita can be uh, right. very soon be taken to the right. Rouse Avenue court as well because uh, this was in connection with the South group lobby that was initiated so uh, you know uh, 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 on one side, K. Kavita, soon to be appear in Rouse Avenue Court. On the other, it is Arvind K. Jriwal. Right. Uh, K. Kavita has been already sent to ED's custody up to March 23. Thank you for watching this video. Namaste, my dear friend. Thank you.